Hi guys, how are you all? So I am Asit Sheikh from Icon Design and welcome back to our channel. So we are continuing our handyman tutorial series. If you are following our playlist, you already know we talk about this in the Android version. Now we'll move to the iOS. So for the iOS, we have to change the builder identifier, version of the app, and also the build of the app. So in this video, we will see how to do it just like the Android version, but in iOS. So let's start. So first of all, you have to open the Android Studio and in that we will open our Flutter project and then we will give our path that is example Flutter and we will open it in the Android Studio. This will take some time according to your device and then we will run a command which is Flutter pubcat and we will let the command run and after that we will write another command that is cd ios and after that we will also run in another command that is pop install so the process will start for the installation this whole thing will install and it will take some time according to your device configuration then it will be shown you that they are successfully done with the pop-up then you will go into the ios folder and indeed there is a pop file where we will open the ios with xcode so it will take you to the xcode there we can see we have this whole panel where we have identify in which we have bundle identifier so we have given this random name to it that is com.icon.example you can change it however you want according to your identifier and then below that we have version and also we have the build so this all are in the same panel for ios but it was different for the android so it is easy in ios to do it now let's move to the firebase configuration if you have follow our video then you know we have already made a configuration file console in the firebase so i will just add a new app for the ios from here and then we'll give the identifier here we will just copy it from the export and paste it there and you can simply register your app this will like no much time so after the registration of application you can download the google service info.plist file from here it's little different from the android version then we will just continue the other process and we'll continue the console now we will move to the x code in the runner we will just simply take our uh, plist file and drag it there and it will be added to your application we will just click on finish and it will be added we'll just click on that you can see it has been added into your device we have changed the firebase configuration and we have also seen how to change the identifier name then the version and the build of the ios version it was so simple to do it so this is where we end our video if you are getting stuck at any point you can check out our playlist for handyman tutorials it will be so easy for you guys and we are here to make your job simple so just stay around with us like this video subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon and share it with your friends and our community just go to our website check out our blogs too and follow us on our social media account so till then assalamu alaikum